It's less time and more flavor. Our next guest has created a super simple cookbook that offers easy to make dishes that require less ingredients and less time in the kitchen. Having spent several hours last night meal prepping, uh, I could use this. Uh, it's called Half Baked Harvest and author Tegan Gerard. She's joining <laughs> us now, opening up the chapters, giving us a taste of the book. Hello, it's great to have you. Hello, yeah, man, S meal prep, that's a, Good for you. <laughs> and so I'm, I'm trying. Yeah, good for you. I, it's like 1 a.m. Like, I don't want to cook anymore. Uh, you, here's the deal. You come from uh, a family of working smarter, not harder. You get nine. Family of nine. That's where you come from. So you had to cook smart, yeah. cook fast, and make it delicious. Well, that, that's always the goal, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, so tell us uh, what, what gave you this inspiration. Yeah. Yeah, so like you said, I come from a big family and I've really been cooking since I was in middle school. I uh, started cooking more to help my dad out in the kitchen. He was always the one that did dinner. Um, and, you know, we would eat super late because he worked nine to five and then would go to the gym afterwards. So I kind of just weaseled my way into the kitchen and started kind of cooking and throwing things out there to my family and seeing what they liked and didn't like and had a lot of fun with it. So I ran with it and cooked all through middle school, all through high school, and then started Half Baked Harvest, the blog, um, after I had graduated high school. And I kind of, uh, again, ran with it and took it from there. So and now we have cookbooks and all this great stuff. How cool is that, man? It just all because of necessity. You had to help dad out in the kitchen, and now here you are with your own cookbook. Yeah. These are great. This is great. Well, you know, I really grew a love for it. I think that um, food is always, you know, the first thing that people think about, and it's such a great connection. and. I love, I love being able to get, uh, serve it to people. No question. So let's talk about some of that food, your go-to fall recipes. Uh, great fall produce out there right now. What do you make? Yeah, so these are, I have some of my favorite recipes in front of me here today, and they incorporate so much amazing fall produce. Um, this slow roasted salmon is all made on one sheet pan, so that's great. Like you just throw it in the oven, don't even have to think about it, and dinner's done. Uh, it incorporates some, acorn squash, which is in season right now, as well as pomegranate arrows. Um, I have partnered with Palm Wonderful today, and what I like to do with this salmon is when I pull it out of the oven, I top it with their Palm Palm Fresh Arrows, and it adds a really nice, juicy burst of flavor and pop of color as well. Very cool. Um, and then over here, I have some slow braised short ribs. I think that short ribs are such a delicious thing to uh, start cooking in the fall. They're really hearty and uh, they take a while to cook. So I throw them in the slow cooker along with some sweet potatoes and let that slow cook all day long. And then when you come home from work or wherever you are, dinner is completely done and all you have to do is put it together. Wow. So easy and it's just a really great like stick to your bones kind of meal mm -hmm. that everybody loves. So I love that one. And then um, over here I have my fall harvest salad. I love this salad. It is great for an easy, you know, any night of the week salad, but also really beautiful on the Thanksgiving table as well. And again, I have topped it with those pom-pom arrows. And what's really uh, cool is they come in these convenient packages now that you can just literally open them up and sprinkle them over the salad. So no time at all involved in that. And then um, of course you can't, you can't end, end any meal without a little bit of chocolate. Of course. Uh, this is my 10 minute chocolate mousse. And this mousse is light, it's creamy, it's so chocolatey. I mean, everybody loves it, it's so good. Fantastic, man, oh man. So where do we get this book? How do we, how do we bring these recipes into our own home? <sighs> well, it's very easy to find this book. You can find it wherever books are sold. So your bookstores, Amazon, wherever. Um, and this is Happy Tarver, super simple. So if you're looking for approachable recipes that you can make any day of the week and serve to your family and friends and really love them, you can find them all in here. They're, well, fantastic and congratulations. And uh, were, you the, were you the middle child? Thank were you the you. youngest? Were you the oldest? You know, I am smack in the middle. Oof. I have uh, three brothers ahead of me two brothers below me and a little little sister. So I am right in the middle. Well, Tegan, <laughs> I will say this. You, you've, you've turned out very well. The middle child, it's a coin flip. You did very well for yourself. Congratulations. Thank you. And Thank we're looking you so forward much. to getting the book. Thank you. Half Bake Harvest. It Thank features more than 125 recipes from instant overnight meal prepped and easy comfort foods as well. For more, head to the website on your screen. Clarkson Potter, Potter Publishing, rather, and Palm Wonderful, both proud sponsors of the Morning Blend.